Hey guys, what is going on? GT2King here, back today with another video. And in the past, I made a video on this Backpack.tf automatic, which is a bot that basically reads your listings on Backpack.tf and accepts trade offers based on what your listings are set to, like the set price and stuff like that. So it's actually gotten some big updates, like you can now do buy orders and stuff like that. So I'm just gonna update my tutorial a bit. So the first thing you want to do is obviously install Node.js and uh, you just like click download for Windows, recommended, whatever and it'll have like the program download then you want to do, then what you want to do is go to this link with the downloads and you want to select the latest one ending in all so we're gonna go with this one they're, they were both released on the same day but this is the 64-bit version so if you have a 32-bit just download this one I guess so yeah, I haven't actually used this program yet, so I'm just kind of doing it live based on what the instructions say. And yeah, we're just, this should be ready to download. And the cool thing about this program obviously is that it does everything automatically for you. It also confirms mobile confirmations as well, which is a huge plus for a lot of people. So we're going to open that up right here. And then what you want to do is go to like your desktop and let's go like backpack tf bot and we'll name that there and we're just going to extract everything into that folder. You could have the folder wherever you want, it doesn't really matter. But now that it's ready, all you have to do is run the automatic.bat. And now what you want to do is log in with your Steam username and your password. Let me put that in and it's also going to ask you for your steam guard app code so we're just going to pick it up from sda right now it's that five digit code on your phone i'm going to remember my login for now just going to type in yes and now what you want to do is get your backpack.tf token so you could get this by going to your backpack.tf logging in going to settings and then in settings go to the advanced tab and if you don't have a token just click generate a new one but mine is right here so we're going to copy and paste that and it should be logging in now so the trade offers won't be confirmed automatically in order to get here okay so if you guys want it to confirm automatically or if you plan on confirming trades by yourself you don't need this tip but i'll have these two links in the description one is for the identity seeker on android and one is for the identity seeker on an ios for SDA it's pretty easy. I think you just go to the MA files tab or the folder and open the one with your Steam ID and it's in there already. So if you guys need any help with that, just comment below and I'll try and help you as much as possible. But now some things you can do is one, well, you could get your identity secret, but we don't care about that right now. And we're going to actually try to do toggle buy orders. So that's what toggle space buy orders disabled buy orders okay so they're already enabled so if we do toggle okay so what this means is let's say we go and create a listing for one of my items let me try one real fast so if we say like we want to sell this lock and load for 0 0.05 refined just send a trade offer if you want like item offers and item overpay and stuff like that Make sure you check the allow negotiation, otherwise it's going to be cancelled by the bot. So we're just going to go ahead and do that. That's actually not my trade URL. So I think, yeah, I don't, it doesn't look like my trade URL. I think it's my bots actually. So we're just going to wait. Put your trade URL if you haven't done it already. And we'll create the listing. And as you can see, it should have the little lightning tab. Yeah, so if you click on this, it'll just open it. Yeah, you can send a trade offer, but when someone sends you the trade offer, it'll just accept it automatically. So yeah, that's pretty much it basically. I don't really know what else to check, so I think you could do this with unusual effects as well. Yeah, you can do this with unusual effects because I've seen some buyers that do it. And yeah, that's basically it. If you guys need any help, let me know in the comments below. And yeah, peace.